We're going on a boat safari and I'm so excited. Walking down to breakfast. We got the typical Costa Rican breakfast. Mm, looks good. This time they gave us little fruit plates and a whole bread plate, which looks amazing. And this is our view. We just finished breakfast and now we're off to our boat safari. So excited. It's gonna be so much fun. If we don't see a crocodile, I'm gonna lose my mind. <laughs> uh, there's a good chance we're gonna see one. It's not guaranteed, but they said we could see crocodiles, plenty of birds. Always um, the birds. Monkeys and maybe some other animals too. Iguanas, we've seen a lot iguanas. of iguanas though. Iguanas, we saw one just out by the pool. I'm hoping earlier. for crocodiles and monkeys. We just saw a sign that said, beware of crocodiles. Do not swim. Don't swim in the water. I'm pumped. So that must mean there's crocodiles here and I'm sure we're gonna see them. Woo! We just saw our first crocodile. Hey, is that nobody else has in my it, It's like uh, four feet long. For uh, babies, they grow fast. Yeah. They kind of try to reach 10 feet, 11 feet, 12 feet as fast as possible. Okay, crocodile number two. What? Oh, that's so cool. Hey, buddy. We're showing for the roots and the branches, okay? <laughs> they can hold the breath for a long time. How long? All depends. How big they look It can be hours. Really? We just saw our second crocodile. Both of them have been uh, babies. But the first one was like five feet long, I think. Yeah. And the second one was like two feet, maybe. Yeah. It was really cool. They're both small, yeah. But hopefully, we we'll see a bigger one too. I'm so excited. What the heck? <gasps> this is the biggest one we've seen yet. It was just swimming across. There's just some people fishing over here. Oh my gosh, how terrifying. My heart is racing. I feel like it's gonna pop up. That was so cool. It just went back under the water. It was huge. We don't know where it went. <laughs> So it could be anywhere. I cannot believe we just saw three crocodiles. We saw all three of them within like 10 minutes of each other. Now I'm like terrified because I, there was a huge one and it went underwater and now I'm just like there's probably crocodiles everywhere. Probably like yeah they're probably just swimming around down there. The guide said that they can hold their breath up to a few hours. They're all like sprinting over here. Well, as you know, I have no food. <laughs> maybe, maybe another guy. Feeds yeah. Oh my gosh. That's the reason why they kind of come close. Just spotted our fifth crocodile and guess who spotted it? <laughs> so it was me. You each spotted one now all by ourselves. <laughs> We're getting good at this. We could be crocodile hunters. <laughs> Probably. I want to get out of the boat and wrestle one. I'm not excited that we're going snorkeling tomorrow. 
Zero percent of me is excited for that. Because there could be a crocodile. Or a bull shark. Bull sharks, yeah, those are pretty scary too. There's a giant termite nest. I guess we're getting off the no, boat. The left, I'm terrified. I didn't know this was part of it. Just Master don't get bit by a crocodile. A we're trekking through the mangroves. And I'm terrified because this is right where we saw the giant crocodile. Let's go. <laughs> okay, I think it was worth it. There's so many monkeys. What the heck? There's a monkey. There's a monkey. Look at that one over there. There's like three monkeys. Wow. Holding the body. If you look up, don't open your mouth. Oh, there's one right above me. He said don't stand under them. Awesome. That's pretty low, huh? Howler monkeys. There's so many of them. Worth stepping on crocodile land for, for sure. <laughs> Moving too. Oh, there it goes. I'll check the crocodiles first. We don't use the lead. Jacob was freaking rocking the boat. We literally saw a giant crocodile right there. Just stepped out of the boat and the tide came in, so we are walking through the water back. This is where we left. The beach that we're gonna go to is literally to the left. Are we Woo. gonna swim? In the ocean? Yeah. Sure, why not? Oh my gosh, There's, absolutely not. There might just be a couple crocodiles, a couple sharks, it's fine. Okay, that was incredible. <laughs> it was so much fun seeing the crocodiles and the monkeys. We saw six crocodiles, six. Six of them. And like 10 monkeys. And we were just about to go to the beach. Think we're just gonna have to wait it out. So we don't have a microwave, but I want to eat a cup of noodles while we wait for the rain to clear so we can go to the beach. So I made an espresso, but didn't put the little cup in. And now I have hot water for my ramen. It stopped raining and now we are headed to Playa Tamarindo. We just made reservations for dinner at a sushi place. We walked in and said, do we need reservations for later tonight? He said, oh yes, definitely gets very busy. <laughs> so we're glad that we went in just out of chance to make the reservation and he gave us a cabana. Yeah. And so we're just going to be eating it. It looks like a really nice place and we love sushi. So it's yeah. great. <laughs> Like most of the things that we've done, like we've been one of the only people, but at the beach, it's uh, pretty busy. It's popping. If you like surfing, then you should come here because there are many, 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 many people surfing. Yeah, and a lot of people offering surf lessons. Yeah. If it's your first time. That is not a picture. Oh. <laughs> There's another crocodile sign right here. Earlier when we were getting in the estuary, which is just runoff of the salt water of the ocean, there was the same sign. So I feel nervous to get in the water, but I think it's pretty normal that crocodiles swim in the salt water here in the ocean because when we were on our boat safari earlier, it was just runoff of the ocean. And he said there was also bull sharks, crocodiles, and stingrays all in that water. There's like a lot of restaurants on the beach or you could find your own space and yeah, I mean, there's still kind of a lot of people, but you can find a space that's open and just, yeah. it's, you can relax for a long time out here. It's really pretty because there's the beach and then there's like a ton of mountains still. So yeah. 
It's really beautiful. And even when you think it's too hot, it might start raining and then it'll cool you off and then, you know, you'll have a lot more time to spend out here relaxing. <laughs> We just made it back from the beach. Now we're just hanging out in the little town. Whew. We didn't actually get in the water of the ocean. I feel like if we did, we wouldn't be so hot. Uh-oh. Here's our little hut where we're eating sushi. This fan is all I need in life right now. I'm a little bit nervous to eat sushi after we already got food poisoning, but I guess we're going for it. It's okay because I think we got poisoned by an octopus, so if we just stick to regular fish, we'll be okay. Two for one drinks tonight. We love mojitos. We are about to go in on this. Ooh, it looks so good. Mmm, 60 rolls, right? 60. Dang. So 60 rolls, <laughs> 60 pieces. 60 pieces. We're getting there. All right, we got 10 left. Jacob's gonna eat nine of them. Then it's worth it. And then I'm gonna eat one. Well, I'm gonna eat more than one. No, I'm gonna eat one and you're gonna eat nine. Oh. <laughs> you, thought, you thought I was gonna eat nine? I don't know. I'm getting <laughs> full. Oh, uh, so close. My last roll. Where are your chopsticks? We were so close. Hey, 57 uh, pieces though, that's pretty good. For that's two insane. Of us. My stomach is so full. We're on the sixth floor and Jago's making me walk up six flights of stairs. And I'm not happy it's about it. It's good for us, it's good for us. We just got back to our room after climbing the stairs. Whew. We had a fun day. It was so a, much fun. It was a long day, but it was a lot of fun. We saw crocodiles and tons of monkeys, and we got to hang out on the beach and walk around the little beach town and then finish it with sushi and mojitos. We hope you guys have been enjoying our Costa Rica videos. Um, we'll be posting in South Africa pretty soon. So make sure you guys subscribe to follow our adventure and drop your name below so we know who you are. That'd be super fun. Yeah, thanks for watching, guys. We really appreciate it. Good night.